بسم الله الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته كان رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم أجود الناس وكان أجود ما يكون في رمضان he used to be so generous صلى الله عليه وسلم and in Ramadan specifically he used to be seen more generous and so we, we grab this opportunity to bring your attention to helping others and supporting them during the Mubarak month of Ramadan there are so many gates of khair and one of those gates of course uh, is Africa Muslim Agency doing amazing work serving the community in so many ways mashallah nationally and internationally and all this is through your generous support we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to accept from them Allahumma ameen we have one of the leaders and directors of uh, Africa Muslim Agency Mr. Idris assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh jazakumullah khairan for joining us this morning Allah bless you Allahumma ameen maybe you can uh, shed some light on what what happened during the uh, the, since the beginning of Ramadan, what was achieved and what you intend to achieve, inshallah, in the last 10 uh, days of Ramadan. Shukran, nah. Sheikh. Assalamu alaikum. So, for the first 20 days, alhamdulillah, we were very active in about tw- uh, 15 countries Mashallah. worldwide, starting in South Africa, across our borders in Mozambique, Malawi, all the way up to parts of Africa. And what I've now heard is that we are going to extend that hop in the next 10 days, even as far as Burkina Faso. So this last 10 days of Ramadan, Africa Muslims Agency has decided to, to uh, give support to additional 10 countries, mm. right f- as far as Burkina Faso up in Africa. So sure. our, our 10 days with 10 countries will make it a much wider reach that we will make uh, for this Ramadan, inshallah. And Africa Muslims Agency's pledge this Ramadan is to bring uh, food and water to those who are fasting, alhamdulillah. Mm-hmm. And with the support of the donors, we have been able to increase to those 10 countries, alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. So so basically, you, you're going to extend the country. You're still doing in, in the countries that you are in? Indeed, we are. And you're going to to add more countries as Absolutely. well? Absolutely. And is it only uh, food and drinks, or is there anything else? That uh, we do hot meals. We do uh, family hampers. Mm. Uh, particularly in Africa, we do the water wells because of water being very important um, um, in Africa particularly Malawi and Mozambique, where we have a lot of campaigns. We feed at our masajids. We also have food hampers that go out generally throughout uh, the month of Ramadan to all 15 countries, including the 10 that we plan Mm -hmm. uh, to do now. MashaAllah. I think we heard in the news about that track that uh, got ambushed. Uh, Can you comment on that as well? Absolutely, Mm -hmm. Sheikh. So we have trucks that are assigned to go to various areas in uh, Mozambique. And you know, Mozambique is a very difficult terrain. We work in the north of Mozambique, up in the Zambezia province. Mm-hmm. So one of the trucks who were le- was laden with food uh, destined to go to a village got ambushed, uh, sadly, by p- people who were extremely hungry. They were in a state of absolute poverty. So this truck was then set aside and people were allowed to take the food from that truck. We've subsequently uh, um, got the truck going again. We've replenished the truck and the truck has now been able to go back to that particular area, very far in the north of Mozambique. And this is due to the wonderful support from the uh, donor base, alhamdulillah. MashaAllah, MashaAllah. And I believe also we have uh, some campaigns in Malawi. I think Malawi also is suffering from some... Absolutely. Mm. We've just come out of Cyclone Freddy that affected large parts of Malawi. Lots of the infrastructure was washed away during that period of time. But Alhamdulillah, AMA, with the masajids, um, they are normally built um, above the ground. We have a very strong uh, stone foundation or cement foundation that is laid. So the mosques were not affected. The Mm. masajids are still very active. We have a lot of feeding taking place um, at the various masajid. Um, you know, sponsored by the donors um, around uh, around the world, alhamdulillah. And we do a lot of family hampers as well, where families are able to come to receive food. And this is part of the Feed the Fasting for this Ramadan, mm-hmm. alhamdulillah. MashaAllah. And your other campaigns uh, be, beside that, like in uh, Syria, Palestine, etc., this is all still running. Alhamdulillah. What I would advise some of our donors to go on and follow our social media. We are uh, putting a lot of the Instagram posts on, particularly coming from the areas like Afghanistan, Yemen, um, uh, from a lot of the countries right now, Palestine, Gaza. There's a lot of feeds coming through, but particularly uh, in Afghanistan daily, we are feeding within various parts just outside of Kabul. MashaAllah, MashaAllah. Now, now uh, we want from you some messages to the people who are watching us right now. Uh, how they should donate? Why should they donate, especially in the last 10 days of Ramadan? 
SubhanAllah. So my appeal to all our donors out there who are listening and tuned in this morning, our appeal at Africa Muslims Agency is to be part of the last 10 days, SubhanAllah. This is the time for great reward, especially when one is feeding the fasting, bringing water to the fasting. And my appeal would be that you follow us on social media, visit our offices, call our offices, get involved in our feeding campaign, as well as uh, go to our website www.africamuslimsagency.co.za to help us to encourage 10 more countries to be fed, inshallah, with your support. Inshallah, yeah. inshallah. Jazakumullah khairan for this information. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala continue to use you and support you, and uh, may you grow from strength to strength so you can support more more countries inshallah amen shukran so much khair. Khair. shukran to give, giving us this opportunity allah this bless you ya rabbal alamin ya rabb jazakallah khairan sister jazakallah khair all right uh, with that we came to the end of the segment of our program we're going to be taking a short break we'll come back after the break inshallah